Hey gearheads and DIY mechanics, welcome back to our weekly tools channel. Today, we're taking a closer look at the Foxwell BT705, a car battery tester that can help you diagnose problems and avoid getting stranded on the side of the road. So, let's get started. Why you need our Foxwell BT705 battery tester. Car batteries lose their power and performance with time hence the need to have them checked from time to time. Our Foxwell battery load tester will help you test the health of your car's battery and remind you to keep the battery in time to avoid unnecessary damage. It is important to know if the battery is still in good condition or if we need to replace the battery. Also, you can check the battery by yourself in seconds to help you quickly fix vehicle problems and save you money and time. Great! As you can see, the BT705 provides a clear and easy to understand analysis of the battery's health. In this case, it shows the battery is good, but if it were bad, it would tell you exactly what's wrong. Here are some benefits for using Foxwell BT705. Preventative maintenance by regularly testing your battery with the BT705 you can identify potential problems before they leave you stranded. Peace of mind knowing your battery is healthy gives you peace of mind on the road. Save money a timely battery replacement can be much cheaper than dealing with a dead battery and a tow truck. Foxwell BT705 Car Battery Tester Pros and Cons Pros Wide range of battery testing Multiple test functions Easy to use Accurate results Optional Bluetooth connectivity Cons Limited warranty information Cost effective may require some mechanical knowledge. Overall, the Foxwell BT705 is a versatile and accurate battery tester that is a good option for professional mechanics and serious DIY car enthusiasts. However, the cost and potentially required knowledge for interpreting results may make it less suitable for casual users. If you're interested in learning more about the Foxwell BT705 car battery tester or want to see it in action, check out the links in the description below. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and let us know in the comments which OBD to scanner you prefer or if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.